Bonner got injured, and Hatcher's had a terrific year with 23 touchdowns on the first play. He has to be smart with the football. I wonder if Marcel Murray's got to get involved. Here he is, the tailback, and he chants. And he's got it on the field on a third and six. Hatcher on the move will throw to Murray, and Murray's to deal that football to Murray out on the edge. Hatcher now, as you said, takes the shot. They're going to play press coverage, rolled up on the line of scrimmage. Another fake to Murray. This one deflect third down to maintain possession. Both teams struggling on this down all season, but this time the Red Wolves converted a cross catch radius, but more than anything, the trust of his quarterback. That was a 15-yard pickup for Bayless. He shots versus the second down. Second and 10, a pump fake for Hatcher. Now rolls out and just throws. Red Wolves two of two on third down on this drive. By you bringing pressure. Hatcher escapes it. First down run inside the 35, sliding down from the FIU 33. Hatcher with plenty of time, takes a shot to the end zone and almost caught. Got to get it near him. He can come down with it. Almost pulled that one off as the toss goes. Hatcher throws another dart to Bayless. That's right at the sticks. The FIU's going to have to win versus Bayless. Coach Anderson loves to go quick, wants to go to the end. 11. This is the Camellia Bowl, and this is Arkansas State driving on their first offensive possession against FIU here on a second and 10 inside the 25. And it's Jamal Jones getting the edge inside the 10. By Jones. Jones again. Not much doing there. Foul. Rolling out, Hatcher in zone, touchdown! They're able to connect with his favorite receiver. First time in school history. The head coach of the Red Wolves, Marcel Murray, will get up. Coach Anderson been there for six, this now his sixth season. Hatcher takes a shot, one on one, and it's in. With a breakup, it's third and eight, and it's a handoff. Murray will be stopped shoot to more than one ankle. He's out there hobbled on both. Hatcher tried through the at the top of the route. Adams couldn't get separation. For some reason, Matt just rolled his eye down a distance and forced him to be second 10 plus. Into the second. He and Kirk Merritt, they've got three excellent receivers. Red Wolves humming on offense. All downfield, unable to connect on that last one. Murray. Games again in run support on that previous play. Third and eight with FIU blitzing. Murray on the bubble. Point and pick up the first down. And if I use 40 and a little trickeration, how about this Bayless tried to exactly will execute that ball too far inside. Second and 10, the quarterback sensational on this play in this quarter. Hatcher on a design run. Keep those chains moving. Very well executed, perfect play call. Hatcher serving the entire field finally. Get the Red Wolves on the outside of the red zone. And Receiver would have ended his route. Jamal Jones dancing inside the Adams at the top of the screen. Looking that way into the field, but four passes broken up already. Hatcher underneath throw into the Panthers, of course, able to answer on their own scoring drive. Hatcher does a good job of handling a high snap. A perfect five for five. And as we mentioned, a couple nice runs. Here he is on a second and 10 stepping up and one field that throws a strike to Adams. Hatcher now wants to throw the deep ball to Bayless. Uh, top and bottom of your screen. And instead it's a handoff to Murray and Marcel goes. Adams to the top of your screen and Kirk Merritt in the middle of the three at the bottom. Serving the whole field and will take off. And Lane was able to dodge it. The 15th first down for A-State here in this first half. Underneath the safety valve to Merritt, and Kirk is in some to Merritt successfully. Murray is met after all off enough to keep that defense honest in the run game. Now Hatcher has the ball deflected. Forced into action. They've got that deflection. Third and seven now for Hatcher. Hatcher runs, but this one at that that started right here in this city. So it's Lane Hatcher back on offense at quarterback. Faking to Marcel Murray. FIU physical in their coverage. Hatcher faking the toss. They're seven of 10 on third down. Hatcher, this one. What a fantastic catch that he makes over the middle. 
Hatcher has thrown the deep ball a couple of times tonight. This time it pays off. And they're going after Stanley Thomas Oliver again. We mentioned it. They're not going to let up. It's receiving for the season earlier in the game. Now it's Murray. And ability to make catches with one hand. Hatcher surveys the field and had to set up the play they're most comfortable in, which is a third down. And this one's thrown. Will the Alabama team be in that game? A team that's so used to contending for championships. How motivated will they be versus a Michigan team that's got to get a win? Hatcher throwing the bubble to Kirk Merritt, and Merritt unable to get out of bounds. It's the handoff to Jones. Other than the Omar Bayless down the sideline, but Hatcher's ability to scramble was lethal in the first half. So Lane Hatcher back. But when it mattered the most, he was able to get the conversions. And on this one, it's a, the previous Camellia Bowls have been one score games. Got one safety deep. He's cheated to the Bayless side of the formation. So Murray in the bubble has the first down inside the 50. Jones and Murray, the two tailbacks used tonight, and Jones gets free into the after a pickup of 20. They go right back to him again, and he's so in the first half. Hatcher, one on one ball, in not on the football field currently. It's Jones to the 15 yard. Hatcher. We'll take a shot, open one. Something that Arkansas State loves to do in the red zone. He's the only man, man to lead the Cleveland Browns, the expansion Cleveland Browns, to the play. Second and 10. Looking a ring right now, Lane Hatcher, the transfer from Alabama, in shotgun, trying to throw a fade, and it's a perfect one able to come up with a big explosive catch 30 yards on that play and then on this is the arkansas state defense we have seen all season is murray still on his feet inside the 30. hatcher in all kinds of trouble actions on a third and ten and this is in fumble and then a punt other than that opening drive to score here in the second half. That is Marcel Murray, and Murray doesn't. With only 15 seconds left in the quarter, and it we haven't seen Ray has been five points, setting up to be a very similar finish here. Hatcher in a muddy pocket gets it out to Murray, and then Marcel gets it. And on that third down in the end zone, Arkansas State going for it. Going for it on a fourth and one. Move right there if you come up short. Hatcher, a one-on-one -on -one ball, throwing the rainmaker, and it's picked off. And it 74. is. That penalty is declined. The result of the play is the interception. Timu, 52 to 28. Washington with the early lead in that Mitsubishi Las Vegas Bowl as Hatcher goes to Kirk Merritt, and Merritt has a first down catch. Punt interception has fueled the FIU comeback. First and 10, Hatcher. That's a muddy pocket, and he's that's the 40th sack that Arkansas State has allowed this season. Three tonight in the second half. On a little tunnel, it's Marcel. So well in your days. Arkansas State has struggled with that this season. Third and 10. Well executed there. It is the 12th third down conversions. And get up field. Second and 13 for Hatcher. Underneath, caught by now with nine minutes to play. Hatcher to Bayless and Omar. He picks up the first down as he circles around on that route. Got it the last time. This is a fourth and two. Hatcher in trouble. Somehow spins out of it. Incomplete. Miami invented the turnover chain, but FIU has been opportunistic turn, getting turnover. You're looking at it, the defense for FIU Getting the ball back for their offense. Stepping into that one in a perfect strike. It's Hatcher, and it's Bayless off to the races. There is a flag down, but Omar's going to take a defender. Blindside block. Offense, number 81. 15 from the bottom. So there's a play. Yep. 
Yeah, that is a big call in the getting a 65 yard play. But on the next play, it's Bayless getting behind the defense again. There are more flags on the field with Omar inside the 15. This is a handoff to Jones and Jamal. Red Wolves are inside the FIU 15. Hatcher in zone, strike. So trying to put this on ice, Marcel Murray is stopped at the four and his entire team, but they are 215 away from a bowl win as Murray goes around. Handling and ball security paramount. Murray on a third and five, and he's going to be short. Tackled at the third.